I'm Steph from stephendel.com here with your summer challenge tone tummy ab workout. These are a few of my favorite moves to tone and sculpt great summer bikini ready abs. Now whatever your summer challenge goal is, you're going to be able to achieve it by getting a strong core first. So let's focus on abs. Before we get started, I want to give you your pre-workout pep talk. Through the whole workout, I want you to remember that you are so much stronger than you think. And I want you to dig deep. Whether for you it's one extra crunch or ten extra crunches, I want you to really go for it. I know you can. Through this whole workout, I want you to remember, and this is a postable quote, that your mind will quit a thousand times before your body does. So feel the fear and do it anyway. So let's jump right in and get to it. All right, here we go. First move, come on down to a plank position. Right here, you wanna have your hands underneath your shoulders. You also, when you come down to your elbows, you want your elbows to be underneath your shoulders too. The thing I want you to remember about this move is stay in a plank position the entire time. I don't want your hips to move up too high and I don't want them to drop too low. You wanna stay in a nice flat back position. Now this move is really going to be effective. When people ask me what I do for abs, this is the number one move that I tell them. I love this move, it works your entire core, your obliques, which is the sides of your abs, your arms, your legs, everything. Everything is really engaged. So for this, it's going to start to burn soon. Get ready. You know, you just want to push through it. When you feel that burn, that's your body changing. That's your body sculpting itself. Don't just give up when it starts to hurt. I want you to push through the pain. You can do this. It's only a few minutes and then it's over. So you can do that. Now give me a few more. Come on down to your elbows, raise up to your hands. Really push at this point. If you're in your third set, you're hurting. So keep going. All right, next move, come on down to your mat. You want your hands to be at your sides and your feet to be up. So you're gonna start by lifting your hips. You almost wanna act like you're putting a footprint onto the ceiling or if you're outside, onto the sky. So keep lifting with your hips. What this is gonna do is it is going to engage your abs, especially your lower abs. So we're talking nice, flat, lower ab area and that is what everybody is looking for, especially in tank tops, crop tops, bikinis. So this move is excellent for that. And you're really gonna start to feel this too. Remember, again, I want you to dig deep. You can do this. It's only a few moves, and I want you to do three sets of them. You can. Okay, two more, you can do this. One, make this one the best one yet. Two, nice work. Just a couple seconds rest, and then we're gonna get moving again. I want you to get into the position with your hands behind your head and you're gonna start lifting up into a crunch. And then you're gonna twist to the right side, twist to the left side. On this one, you wanna make sure that your elbow is touching your knee. And you don't wanna be pulling at your neck, you wanna just be lifting with your abs. So that's really important. Check yourself right now and make sure you're lifting with your abs and not pulling on your neck. Okay, keep going, you got this. This one is going to engage upper, lower abs, obliques, the sides of your abs, and uh, that's why I put these two together. You wanna have a little mixture of the two and this gets it all done in one shot. So keep pushing, you've got this. I know that you're hurting. I know that this is killing. You're on your third move 
and this is really starting to burn now, but you can do this. You've got it, and I'm here with you. I'm doing it right here with you. There we go. Okay, twist to the side. Twist to the other side. Crunch it up. Twist to the side. Twist to the other side. Yes, okay, another one of my favorite ab moves. You're gonna come over to your side for this one. Rest your head in your hand and put your feet together facing forward. So what you're gonna do, keep your feet together the whole time, you're gonna lift to the side. This is really gonna isolate your obliques, those muscles on the sides of your abs. And what that does is it tones you up, gives you a nice slim waist, and really gives you some nice definition that's gonna be rocking in your bikini. And you can do it. Keep pushing through, so keep lifting. And then we're gonna add on this one at the end a little extra something because I know that you guys are capable of it. If you can't do it right now, try doing it just in the last set. And then eventually I want you to do it for all three sets. So lift it up, raise one leg, lower down. This is really engaging that core. So you're giving it extra double whammy on those abs. Yeah, nice work. All right, just a few seconds rest. We're gonna flip it over to the other side, even it out and lift those legs again. So put your feet together, your head's in your hand, other hand you can place on your hips or on the side and you're just lifting and get ready, prep yourself. You can do this extra part at the end where you isolate and just lift your one leg. Get ready to do that this time. Okay, what we're doing right now, focus, dig deep, really lift those legs. This is going to make some serious changes and you can do this. This is just the beginning. This is teaching yourself that you are capable of whatever you want to achieve. So right now, I want you to dig. There we go, let's do this extra leg move. Lift it up, put it together, lower down. You've got this, now give me two more. Lift, together, down. Up, lift, together, down. Nice work. Okay, few seconds rest before this final move of the workout. You can do this, remember, dig deep, drive, you can do this. Okay, so balance on your butt, you wanna lift your feet up off the ground. Now, if this is hard to start with, you can keep your feet on the ground, but eventually I want you to move up to this feet off the ground. I want that to be a goal of yours. So now put your hands together and you're twisting from side to side. And I want you to touch the ground when you get to each side. That means you're really gonna be curling and engaging that core. And again, keep your back flat. You don't wanna have any kind of curve in your spine. You want it to be nice and straight to really get the most out of this move. Now you should really be feeling it now, especially if you're on your third round. This is going to be rough but you can do it. Find the excitement in pushing past what you think you can't do and making the impossible possible. You've got this. Great job, guys. I hope you love this routine, and it's great to pair this workout with any of the Summer Challenge fitness workouts from the workout schedules on stephendel.com. You can also, after this workout, check in with me on Facebook and Instagram and let me know how it went. You can also subscribe here on YouTube for more videos like this, and I'll see you soon.